So in ChatGPT, there is a feature called live screen sharing, and this is quite similar to the live mode in Gemini AI. Basically, you are allowing ChatGPT to see exactly what's going on on the screen, and therefore AI can understand your situation better and can give you much more relevant answer. For example, maybe you have a problem with your phone and you need some guidance on how to solve the problem. And I think it makes sense to share uh, the screen to ChatGPT so it knows the problem and can give you the most appropriate response. So uh, in this video, I'm going to show you how you can use or how to enable this feature on ChatGPT. Now, before I show you how you can do it, there are a few things that you need to know. Now, according to ChatGPT, this feature is apparently available in pretty much all versions of ChatGPT. It is available for the mobile, web, and the desktop versions of ChatGPT. But from what I can tell, I can only access the screen sharing feature on the mobile app version. I don't see the option for the web and also the desktop version of ChatGPT. And even though ChatGPT says uh, the feature is available to pretty much all versions, but I think they are releasing this on stages. So that's why some people might not be able to use this feature. Anyway, I'm going to show you how you can do it only on the mobile app version. So because that's the only version that I can access right now. Anyway, I'm going to fire up my Android phone. Let's open ChatGPT. And basically, in order to share the screen, you have to open the advanced voice pod by tapping on this button. Now, I cannot narrate this video and also talking to ChatGPT at the same time. So I'll just start talking with ChatGPT and I hope you can still follow along by seeing exactly the menu and the buttons that I click to open the option to enable the screen share. So I'll start uh, talking to ChatGPT now. Hey, can you tell me what's going on on the screen? Sure. So, it seems like you're on a screen sharing or casting interface. It looks like there's an icon in the middle showing that your screen is being shared or ready to be shared. And there's a little note at the bottom that says you've got eight minutes left on whatever session you're running. Uh, okay, so okay. Uh, can you tell me what you are seeing right now? Absolutely. So, right now, you see that you're basically on a screen that shows a big sharing or casting symbol in the center, kind of like a rectangle with a little broadcast icon. And the interface is mostly white and minimalistic. Okay, how about now? How about now? Can you see what I'm seeing right now? Yeah, I can see your home screen now. It looks like you switched out of that casting app and I can see a bunch of app icons. You've got things like Chrome, Keep Notes. Okay, Notes. what app that I'm using right now? I can see the big Chrome logo on the screen and it looks like it's just loading up. So yeah, you're in Chrome. Okay, so that's basically how you can enable the screen sharing feature in ChatGPT. There is a little bit of delay at the beginning, but beyond that, it seems to be working just fine. And yeah, I think it's going to be very useful in some situation. So that's how you can enable the screen sharing feature, especially on the mobile app version of ChatGPT. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you on my next video.